How's it guys? Welcome to the channel. In this tutorial, I want to share with you how I made this Ganama type beat. So without further ado, let's listen to the beat first. Then I will explain how I made it. Okay, let's go to the beat. Okay, this is the beat. The first thing I did, I set the BPM to 112, as you can see here. So after setting the BPM, let's go to the music. The first thing I set was the drums. So let me play the first one, which is a snare. Let's listen how it sounds. And I put another snare. Then the next one. Then the other snare. So let's listen how those sounds. Then I put another snare for the feel, this the transition is this one. Again, the next one, also for the fill. Now let's go to the next one, the third one, also for the fill. This is a snare also for the field. So let's go to the next one. It's also a snare, sorry. Let's go to the next one. What's this? Let me see. Oh, I don't know. Let's let's listen to it. Okay. Ah, it's a kick. <laughs> then I play the kick. Uh, it just I just put here. Feel each four steps. So, okay. Let's go to the next one. Okay. Just a snare. Let's go to the next one. The last one. For drums, it's a pack mission too. It's, oh, let's 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 listen how it sounds. Okay, let's listen to the drums, all the drums. Then we go to the instrumentation.
Okay, I'm gonna play one by one so that you can hear what is it doing. Okay, the first one was this one. Then the other one. Okay, the next one. The next one. Okay, the next one. I'll play all of them because those are drum shields. This transition. Then the kick. Okay, let me put the last one. Okay, let's go to the instrumentation. The first one was this one. I use this preset. This codex from Waves is a it's a grid synthesizer. I've I've used this DAT piano preset, the default preset. I didn't change anything. I just put the preset and I boom, I was playing the chords. So let's see how the the chords sound. I've played the, this one is a, oh what, what is this? It's B. B, B, B chords, B, B major, it's a B, B major. Then we play, I played F, F sharp, F sharp, major also. Then I come to, it's a, what is this? Okay, it's a D sharp also, major. Then a, a no, it's not a, it's not a D, it's a C. It's a C sharp, then I play D. D sharp also. Let's see how the chord sound. A very cool sounding project. Oh, sorry. A very cool project. Pro pro progression. Okay, let's go to the next one. I think I've copied the same progression and I put in, in other instruments. So let me see. Yeah, it's the same progression. Let's see the instrument. And a pad, it's a pad. Okay, let's go to the, let's see how it's on. Okay, let's see how, how it, it sounds together, how they sound together, that's it. Okay, let's go to the next one. Uh, okay, I use this pad to play some little melody, little dark melody, there in the background. It's a very cool melody, but it must stay, must, must stay there in the background. So let's see the next one. It's the same melody, but different instrument. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, I use this preset. Go to T. Just find here in this plugin. I will find this preset. So let's go to the next one. The last. Oh, let's let's see how all of them sound together.
then the base i've used this one shot from sd slick digital base hall base one shot this is my base kit one shot i like it so i've played this i just copied the, the root notes from the chords Then I'll play this little, little variation, little transition, something like that. So let's play all the beat. <laughs> yeah that's it for the beat i hope you like the beat so if so consider subscribe and click the notification bell so that you won't lose or you don't lose any of my next video peace